Hello, welcome. In this short video, let us see how to use MATLAB to compute the energy and power of a given signal. And we will verify the results with theoretical uh, values. Given the signal y of t is equal to 1 plus j, that is a complex valued signal, that is 1 plus j into e power j by t by 2, that is a complex exponential. So y of t is a complex valued signal and the value of t is from 0 to 10 of finite duration, that is a complex valued signal of finite duration, we want to find both energy and power of this signal. First let us look at the MATLAB code for this uh, computation. <coughs> so energy and power. So y of t is given by 1 plus j into exponential of uh, j pi by 2, j pi t by 2. So the energy calculation is uh, based on the definition that is uh, the definition E is integral minus infinity to plus infinity modulus of x of t square dt. And since x of t is only defined from 0 to t, this is equal to, uh, zero to 0 to 10. So it is integral 0 to 10 absolute value of 1 plus j into e power j pi t by 2 square dt. So we have to compute this integral using MATLAB code. So by using the symbolic toolbox and then the function int, we are able to compute the uh, integral of the square of the absolute value of the given signal uh, with the limits from 0 to 10. Uh, then we can add the value e. Similarly, we can also compute the power by using the definition limit t tends to infinity e by t. And since e is a constant here, p is equal to e by infinity. So p is obviously going to be 0. So let us look at the results. So we can clearly see that the energy e is equal to 20 and power p is equal to 0. Let us look at the theoretical values. So since the signal uh, uh, is 1 plus j into e power j pi t by 2, it means the absolute value of this exponential part is 1. So we are left with a constant. So absolute value of 1 plus j, absolute value of 1 plus j square integral 0 to 10 uh, dt. So this must be equal to 1 plus 1 uh, that is basically 2. So, so this value is 2 and this integral should be equal to 10. So the value is 20. So that is what we get in the MATLAB. And similarly the power p is limit t tends to infinity e by t. And since e is a constant, this value is e by infinity and e is a constant uh, and is equal to 20 so 20 by infinity is equal to 0 so the power is 0 so the signal is finite energy and finite power signal and the power itself is equal to actually 0 so to summarize uh, in this short video we have looked at uh, the calculation of energy and power using MATLAB for a complex signal that is y of t is equal to 1 plus j into exponential of j pi t by 2 and uh, the time duration is from 0 to 10 that is a finite duration complex valued signal. Using MATLAB we found that energy is equal to 20 and the power is equal to 0 and this is based on using the system uh, the symbolic toolbox in MATLAB and using the function INT that basically stands for integration uh, and then we just give the structure of the function as the uh, inputs and then the limits are 0 and 10 we get the value of E and similarly the value of power. So we found that the values are equal to 20 and 0. And then we also verified the same using the theoretical calculations. And the energy is indeed equal to 20 and power is equal to 0. Thanks for watching.